Twitter and even Facebook. It says, um, very dark man, I prophet Jeremiah Fufeni, extend forgiveness to you. I am withdrawing the court case against you. Following the teachings of Jesus, who preached peace and corrected sinners, I forgive you. May you learn from your mistake and walk in righteousness from now on, my son. I don't know how true this is. It's not on his official pages. It's not on his Facebook. It's not on his Instagram. And also, my lawyer have not contacted me. So this is just a false um, news. Also, even if it's true, as you all know, I am somebody that's living in a space where I just talk about what is affecting the society with my God's given platform. And following what Prophet Jeremiah posted, where he said he has a miracle soap um, endorsed by Navdak, that the soap can cure suffering. And I asked that, how? What ingredient? Then I was slammed one billion loss one billion naira lawsuit that lawsuit made me depressed because i thought about what if this man wins me because our justice system in nigeria is broken what if he uses his influence to win me so how do i pay i was even so because i said i will not get this money to pay so is it not better i just end it all i thought about a lot of things that made me depressed it made me sad my family members kept calling me i had to go extra mile to get proof, I spent a lot of money to get proof so that I will not be imprisoned for asking the right question in Nigeria. The only reason why I did it is to protect other Nigerians from products that have not been standardized, you know, because under the laws of NAVDAC, you need to, every product that people intake or people rub, cosmetic pro product and food products must go through NAVDAC to be sure if it's safe for people. That was why I asked, not because I want to defame him. And I was slammed. <laughs> it has made me depressed. <laughs> because how do I pay one billion from this place? I've never heard about them. <laughs> Even if this news is true, I will still have to counter sue him because he has made me depressed. He has made me sad. We have to counter sue him and use the money. I'll take the money to Karamajiji, the home where there are disability people. A lot of them, I saw them. They are also going through a lot. I had a lot of compassion. So if I counter sue him and I get the money, I'll give part of the money to them. Maybe send their children to go to school so that when they make money, they can take care of their disabled parents. And also, I will use some of the money to build boreholes in a community that don't have boreholes. I will not eat one naira. If I eat one naira, let it not be well with me. <laughs> All I wanted was to protect other Nigerians. <laughs> <laughs> I've had sleepless night thinking about where we get one billion naira just in case he uses his influence. And you know, Nigeria, people that have power can do anything. <laughs> mm. I promise I wasn't going to cry. And he said he wants to forgive me. And see, what I was saying is a lie. I don't know if it's true. And I don't believe this is true. This boy, they worry. Hey. You can't learn. He's very dark man, and I hear you. Oh my God, mommy.